right, guys. So the Sharp Aquos Crystal, uh, um, I was working on a this video, and uh, one of the someone commented, "You know who you are." Shout out to you. Uh, asked me if I'm going to do benchmarks, and so I don't normally do benchmarks, uh, but for this device, I thought it was it's a pretty unique device, so I decided to go ahead and, and do a benchmarks on some of these. So I'm going to do Quadrant, and I'm going to do um, I think this is Valera, uh, uh, Vel Velma. You know, you know what I'm talking about. That one up there. And I'll do that one last because this is a pretty lengthy test and I'll probably speed through it. All right, so first one is N22. Uh, let's get into that one. Okay, so the video ended, uh, or the uh, and Tutu stopped like that. So let's see what happened. It just kind of cut off. There we go. So scores are good. Uh, you can see there. Seventeen thousand is not bad at all. Let's see, go to ranking. Where's that chart at? You know the chart I'm talking about? I haven't used uh, in two to in a long time. I want to get to that one where it shows the graph. Oh, here we go. Bar chart. There we go. So you can see where this one falls down here, way below the, some of the rest. But still, that's pretty good. 17,000 is not bad at all. All right, let's go to the next test. All right, guys, let's go to the next test. I had to move to a different part of my office here. I'm going to clear off that desk. So the next one I'm going to run is Quadrant right here. All right, let's run the full benchmark. Okay, so Quadrant is done and let's check it out. So this device got 8,627. You can see there, 8,627. So it actually did pretty good. I mean, it, it for, for what it is, you know, a Snapdragon 400 is pretty good. Did, did pretty good, I'm shocked. All right, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do one more and then uh, this will conclude the benchmarks. This test right here is a very lengthy test, so we gotta definitely have the time lapse this one. All right. All right, guys, so you can see here on that one, it actually scored 1641. Very impressive for Snapdragon 400. I think this device is, should do very well. Uh, let's compare it next to other devices. It says we can do here, see what it looks like. Uh, here we go. So we ranked down here under the Motorola Joy Razor, but above the Galaxy Note, uh, excuse me, Galaxy S3 and the Moto G. So that's about right. It's doing pretty good at 1641. Very impressive. For now, that is the benchmarks I'm gonna do on this device. I will see you guys in the next one. Stay tuned for more videos on this one. Take care.